In this video we're going to look at how to work with vectors on the TI-36X Pro. So we're going to use very simple vectors, easy to remember. So we're going to make U just 1, 2, 3 and V we're going to make 4, 5, 6. And we're going to do U cross V which is minus 3, 6, minus 3 and U dot V which is 32. So first thing we have to do is insert the vectors. So second function, then go to vector and go across to edit. We will edit vector u, so go to 1, and we'll make this dimension 3, so go across to 3. So you can have 1, 2, or 3 dimensional vectors. Don't know why you'd want a 1 dimensional vector, but anyway. 1, enter 2, enter 3. That's that vector entered, so we'll go second function vector again. Second function, then go to vector again, and go across to edit, and then edit vector v, and then we're going to make this 3 again and then just 4, 5, 6, exactly the same, and then we go second function, quit, and quits right next to second function. Now what we need to enter now is we'll do a dot product, so we enter this dot product, u comma v, in brackets, and then we want cross product, which is just cross p, and then u comma v. So I'll show you how to get that. So you go second function, vector, and then under math, you've got these functions. So one gives us the dot product, and so we have to go back into vector, you should, should see an easy pattern here, and then one gets us that, and then second function you've got the dot, the comma rather, on the dot down here, and then second function, and then vector, and two, and then equals, and we get 32 as expected. Exactly the same thing for cross product, go into vector, then go to math, cross product, and then you can access u and v under names, then we want a comma, and then we want V, which is under 2, close the brackets, cross product, and it calculates it there. You can obviously do basic um, functions, basic operations with vectors. You can use do u, and then um, plus, and then we go to vector and go to V. So we can do u plus V and other basic vector operations. So hopefully this, uh, this video is helpful to you and thank you for watching.